I'm here at the National Farm Machinery Show in Louisville, Kentucky with Lee Kilpatrick with Salford Group. We're standing in front of its award-winning, actually, in-crop row cultivator. It won an AE50 award earlier this year. Lee, can you tell me a little bit about it, please, and why it won its award? Absolutely. First off, we appreciate the opportunity, and we're grateful for the award. It's really, does your work good, <laughs> okay. you know, when you, when you see the return on it. So it is a... Um, old becoming new again okay you know back in the day we all cult in row cultivated right you know that's how i grew up but that that's gone away and chemicals and a lot of other things have taken its place and there's still a big need particularly and primarily in the organic community for row crop in row cultivation it also has some pretty good legs we have learned with conventional farmers because they know that in if a situation occurs that through operation or legislation we lose chemicals, right. the game changes a little bit. Exactly. So it's, it's bringing it new, it's adding technology to it, right. it's adding sensors and the ability to move the row unit to dual zone pressure, so you've got yeah. more pressure behind your tires, for example. Uh, wand or camera guidance lets this row unit right. travel uh, 20 inches on its own. Um, and the speeds at which our customers are able to run up to 12 miles an hour. Oh, wow. So the speed and the precision and the accuracy. Uh, traditionally, these customers have bought expensive units brought in from overseas. You know, we wanted to develop in conjunction with other companies at South, we developed this, this unit and it really has some really neat legs. Right. So what kind of widths can this setup be? Uh, oh, that's a great question. I missed the obvious. Okay. Uh, we sell it in a 12, a 16, and coming this year, a 24 unit. Okay. Right now we're at 12 and 16, but we will have a 24 later on this year. It is set up on a traditional 30-inch row at this time. Uh, we, we, we can truly envision other row spacing setups, but that's where we are today, most common uh, row spacing we see for our customers. And the, the guys that um, have run it, guys and gals, they've great experience, accurate, very, very fast. Uh, and that's bringing those elements of control and sensors give us a whole nother operating reality. I think if I heard you correctly, you said 12, 12 miles per hour with 20 inch moving from side to side. That's, that's, that's pretty correct. You've yeah. got a lot of travel yeah. and you can do that via uh, feelers or a camera or both. Right, right. There's a couple of technologies that you can use. Uh, pretty solid. Uh, it's it's an ISO controlled tool. Fairly simple. It's like anything. There's a learning curve. Yeah, sure. And once you once you've got it figured out and set up, um, the row units will pick up on the edges and as applied and as planted areas. So it's a very accurate tool nice. too. Well, something must have certainly made it stand out for the judges. So it won an award. So congratulations on thank, that, Lee. Thank you very much. Is there anything else you wanted to add that I didn't ask you about? It is available for uh, sale today okay. in the continental U.S. And we are open for business. <laughs> Good stuff. And excited. So we're really grateful for, for you coming here and for the, for the award. Okay. It means a lot. All right. Well, thanks very much, Lee, for your time. Pleasure My meeting pleasure. you. Thank you. Thank you.